and again. Another country, another city, another big project, another empty apartment. The Today's paper says, blah, blah, blah. Thanks to many products and services, we don't need to fulfill simple daily tasks, like even shopping itself. From one's own home and without physical interaction, we can obtain almost everything we desire. All the technology increases isolation. It is possible to spend weeks without leaving the house and never be hungry or bored. And behind our stoop-shouldered backs, bees are disappearing from the face of the planet. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. There's always an open sea of possibilities. I cover my loneliness with the perspective of having it all. My face looks entirely different from each profile. I can be whoever I want. They always told me I could become anyone. But I decided I won't become anyone. I will become everyone. I will try everything a little and I will never be an expert only on one subject. And one day the world won't have craftsmen anymore. Already now a skilled hand worker earns more per hour than I could ever dream of. Once my grandpa told me, my little girl, do you know why my business collapsed? Because even if I wanted, I could never understand a customer coming from your inconsistent generation. And that's really it. Running in the morning, six kilometers, then working in a theater, six hours, earning nothing, eating at a fancy lunch bar, dreaming of kartoffelsalat, listening to techno on the way home, going out with friends to the Philharmonic, eating at a cheap Asian spot, walking home to save on taxis, yet planning an expensive internet detox in the mountains, buying a bio smoothie in a night shop, yet finishing the wine in bed. No algorithm could guess who I will be on the next day. No marketing specialist can tell how I am. They collect my data day by day, day by day. If I only could touch those smiling lips, it would help me survive the nights. At nights I can feel the wind going through my body. You know why? Come sit next to me. Touch my body. I can't feel my belly. I think I lost it long ago. Now you know my secret. You know me. I'm simple, maybe complicated. I'm thin. I'm fat. Red, blue, I like blue, do I? I don't know what I like. Would you like me if I like you back? Do I look like what I like? I just need a touch to be unlocked. Touch me, unlock me. It all changed inside of us humans. Maybe even organs look different nowadays. 
and I still feel I could put on different personalities like I did not have to decide on one thing in this life. I guess I don't believe in afterlives. I don't see heaven or hell around the corner. I see myself having this one and only precious thing called life and thousands of different voices in my head telling me I have to achieve goals that are not even my idea. Leaves of plants turn into the direction of the sun just to grow better. What if I have no idea where my son is, and all that I can do is follow my intuition, constantly interrupted by the outside world? In the end, all I want to do is leave the shadow of artificial needs and feel my own hunger. <laughs>